Welcome one and all, whoever may be watching this, this will be part eight of uh, Paper Lily chapter one. Let's jump into this one. Okay, so we are in some kind of facility. We went through the door um, and it looks like this place is big. I think this is the way for us to progress, except for it looks like there's water everywhere. Okay, deeper down, do we have to go this way? That's impossible. Does Arun expect us to swim? Hear me out. What if we took all this water and put it somewhere else? Do you have a screw loose? Look, I know it sounds crazy and we need a bucket. It's impossible. And it would take a lot of trips. I can't believe I'm hearing this. But maybe we can lower the water level somehow. I mean, in all fairness to Sai, we uh, have a bucket. <laughs> all right, so we can't go um, down either of those staircases. That's where we came from. So there is a door up to the north here and then off to the west. Let's just head off this way. It's locked. Okay, I wasn't sure if this flower was something. A bathroom. Um, excuse me. Could you wait outside? What? Oh, of course. I, I guess I'll stay out there. Scream if you need me. I won't. <laughs> All right, Lacey, what are we doing? Now I get to have some time away from that guy. Is it really safe to have him around? Hero would tell me to have a bit of faith in others, but... Hero also wasn't here when you got stuck in the fairy circle ring, so, you know. I wonder if I could ask Hero. Is it even possible to call from here? I still have no signal, but that didn't matter last time. Oh, so then is it really Hero that she's talking to, I wonder? I'll give it a try. Lace! Oh, good. Thank goodness I can reach you, hero. Are you alright? What happened? Are you safe? Yes, I'm okay. Though I did fall down the stairs and wake up in some sort of dungeon. And there's a strange guy following me everywhere. And Rune said there's no way out. Everything is okay, don't worry. Thank goodness. Is everything alright? Why are you whispering? Because there's someone right outside and... An enemy? No, well, he says he's not. And now he's following me around. You made a friend? No. I don't really trust him. But maybe it's better to have company. He might be willing to tag along and help. But that's why it's strange. Why is he willing to tag along? You know how people act around me, Hero. And he's just acting like nothing is wrong with me. Hmm... You sound conflicted. Well, I don't really care. I just... He's just shady. Well, tell you what. It's your choice. You have him tag along and see how it plays out. Or you ditch him. Huh. It's not like you to suggest something like that. 
Well, I personally think you should have a bit of faith in him, but it's up to you. Yeah, that's more like it. I should go. Be careful, Ace. Get back home safely. Yeah. Uh, okay, let's just do it for all of them. I wonder if there's like a pattern that we have to... Oh, something shiny can be seen. Yes. Oh, yay, we got coin. It's just what you want out of a toilet. All right. Looks like a mop that's never been used. Small hand towel. Rusted sink. Something's on this shelf. Oh, nice. Got another fuse. Whatever that's worth. That took a million years. Were you talking to someone in there? No. Did he overhear anything? It kind of sounded like it. I wasn't. Oh. It's cool. I talk to myself sometimes too. Like having a little narrator, right? Sai joined your party. Oh, that's sad. So I have kind of just gone off in a direction. I don't really, oh. Okay, well, let's head back for a hot second. Because there was another way to go. Oh, hello there, elevator. Nothing happens. Okay, maybe we need to get power going there or something. Cool. Head up this way, I guess. Wow, this is actually a big area. I did not um, realize. All right, let's check out what's this way, I guess. Okay. I wanted to check it was a gate. Wait. These two doors open from the outside, so... I'll stay here and hold it open for you. Alright. So I left the party. Oh, hey. Status dormant, awaiting further tests. Um... Okay, I, I'm all about checking these out. I wouldn't mind saving the game first, though, just in case I release a demon and poor Lacey dies. BRB. Okay, um, so there's a hole in the floor there. It's locked. There's something inside. Yeah, I can see that. Oh yeah, there's something inside there too. Okay, so they're all locked. Okay, what else, Trevs? It's good to save the game anyways. Oh, hey. Okay, well, I, I'm assuming we don't need to be there. gate it's locked oh okay I see that's where we came out of oh that's cute okay locked gate probably controls the gate yes 
nothing happens. Excellent. This is such a big area. I can't believe how big it is. Okay, it's locked. Ooh. I mean, this looks like a happy place. Okay, we can't walk off onto the void. Okay. That might have some kind of meaning a bit later on, maybe. This is such a stinking big area. Okay, so we've got the elevator again. I know I keep saying that, but it's it's true. This is stinking huge. Ooh. You drop something. Oh, <laughs> my to-do list, nice. To-do list before you die? Please give it back. You didn't complete it. I know. Why do you, um, I mean, that list looks pretty depressing. I'm aware. Do you want to talk about it? No. Got it. Ah, oh, there's a valve. Uh, yeah, sure. I don't quite know what either of those things are going to do for me, but there you go. There's a note here, in case of emergency, ooh, drain and flood the system. In order for the draining system to work, the correct fuse must be in place. Rotate all four valve handles. This will activate the flood. It is irreversible, so don't do this without notifying the, the rest of the note is torn off. Oh, that's a bit sad, I guess. Um... Okay, so can I... Okay, you hear something unlocking in the distance. You're breaking my emotion. <laughs> oh, of course, this is fuse number 40. Of course it would go there. So then I need to get 25? Wait. Taking that one out might be a bad idea. I saw some doors like that before. I don't think we want to open them. Maybe there's a better way. Oh. <laughs> Let's put that back in, I guess. I don't know. We just need to get... Maybe there's another fuse around. So we need to get, I think, to 55. So we've got 40 minus 15, which is 25, I think. So then we need 25 plus something to make 55. I think is how any of that works. I don't really know. Oh, okay, I see. So 25 is for the doors. That 40 is for the water, yeah, 15 is for lights, 5 is for the front door, maybe? Mmm, not working. Those two thingies look burnt. Oh, they do too. Ah, there's two blown fuses, no wonder. I mean, yeah. That's not how fuse, sorry, I'm not paying attention to this right now. Okay, let's go, let's go. Um, okay. This changes things a little bit because obviously we can't take out 25, which is what we would need. Okay, what I'm thinking I might do is 
put all the fuses back. And then maybe there's another fuse around that we can use. Like if we can open all the doors and such forth. Maybe there's another fuse somewhere around. You could probably fit inside. Oh yeah, there we go. A fuse number 10 for whatever that's worth. Uh, and then we've got some shapes here. Attached to some pipes. Okay, I can't... A slot to place a valve wheel. The indentation has a square shape. Oh, okay, hold on. I need to do this, I guess. So what valve did we get? Uh, the protrusion is square shaped. Okay, so I guess we have to find fuses and find valves at this point. Uh, let's just do nothing for the moment. Let's just put them in. Okay, good to know. This is how we're going to get the elevator to work, I guess. What else is around here? Oh, it's a bucket. Yes. We can add that to our other bucket. Like, hmm... We could try removing all the water with it. This door is to the surface. Huh, it's locked. Are we trapped after all? It can't be. I just came through here. Do we need a key? There's no keyhole. Huh, good eye. We'll just have to do as Rune said and go deeper down. Oh, just kick the door down, guys. Running will make you easier to spot. Hold C to sneak past enemies. Okay, this game just took it up a notch, I guess. Uh, is my dude just going to stand there? Goodbye, sir. Okay, I want to get back to the bird so we can save it. If we're going to have enemies that we need to sneak past. Okay, so there's two more doors around here. Does this work now that we put the fuse in? Nice, okay. Let's just do a quick save. Oh, room's gone. Where you go, Rune? Oh, I wonder if now all the doors will open as well. Oh gosh, this area is so big. <laughs> also, I keep hearing like banging noises. Okay, it's locked. All right, good to know. Some of these doors are just locked. I do have a copper key. Is it like a skeleton key maybe? A large window shaped like a clock towers above you. The time is set to 12. Um, I can't do anything. Okay, there we go. Silhouette of a large clock is reflected here. Okay, I'm just wondering if I need to do anything here. I mean, obviously, yes. Just don't really have anything that would make sense. Okay, maybe we'll find... Oh! There you are! How'd you get in there? I got zapped, like there's something keeping me out. Really? You didn't even notice me gone. 
No. Hold. So what was in there anyway? Anything fun? Yeah, very fun. What, really? What was it? I can't tell you. Huh? Why not? Because it's more fun that way. No way, don't do me dirty like this. It's strange though, why wasn't he able to enter? I don't know, is that really strange? Alright, I should try this key. Let's just make sure it's not a skeleton key of some kind, you know? Okay. Well, I guess onwards and upwards. Um... Whoa! Was this a meeting room or something? What do you think they held meetings about? Wait, who do you think held meetings? Looks like the room where you would plot world domination. Think those windows lead anywhere? You okay? Yes, I just have this persistent headache following me around. Oh, that sucks. A chair, it's nailed to the ground. There's a coat hanging for it. Yeah. Ooh, actually, check the pockets first. Meeting 221 notes. Members are growing increasingly restless. Expressing disapproval for Lilith. Might be planning to oust her. Could get ugly really fast. Okay. And now let's put it on. Ha, <laughs> that's way too big on you. It's cozy, I suppose. I wonder who wore this. Uh-oh. <laughs> what the heck? Hey, hey, what's wrong? Did I just kill her? Wake up! What the hell? Hey, wake up, hey! Damn it! Did I just kill her? Yeah! <laughs> Sensory overload, alright. Don't put the coat on. Alright, so I last saved this um, just as we were checking out the rooms on the left here. So not too much happened there. So let's just head back in here. We'll have to skip through this whole conversation again. Um, okay, yada yada yada. Uh, let's just check the pocket again. I don't know if that's going to be like anything we need to know for any real reason. All right, now we're not touching it, all right? It almost looks like an eye. There's a valve, take the valve. Yay, that's what you're here for, right guys? Don't touch anything else. All right, I'm just looking at the time. This might be a good place to leave it. So, I mean, we found two valves. Um, I'm not quite sure how this helps us. We've obviously got another fuse, which might help us. I'll need to sit down and have a look at all of those. Maybe that can be next video's problems. I don't know. <laughs> Bye.